What is going on everyone and welcome to Wasted. My name is John and I'm actually pretty excited to be trying this game out. I uh, actually had it for a while now. I met some of the people at PAX or the publishers and the people at Adult Swim. I actually got to try this out a little bit but this is my first time playing it on my own. So this is on PC. It's actually on sale if you want to check it out. And I think it might be a little bit interesting. It's kind of like an FPS adventure game. So we'll see. So as you may imagine, this is on PC. So I'm going to show you the options menu real quick just to give you an idea of what it's about. So gameplay, it's kind of like if you have a controller and that's what you want. Audio, it has sound effect and music. We're just going to turn off the music for YouTube reasons. Um, display, you can play up to, I, we're playing it on 1080. You can have all this. It defaults you to the brightness at zero, so you're going to have to tweak that. There's a vertical FOV. We're going to be playing on very high settings, everything, and turned off most of these. Uh, so that's about it. The key bindings are what you expect. Input, also what you expect. Look sensitivity, and if you're playing with a gamepad. So with that said, that's pretty much it. So we're going to start off a new game. Let me know if you guys are going to enjoy it. I could always do more. But with that said, let's get started. The year is 1980. Tensions are at a boiling point between the U.S. and the U.S.S.R. after a thermonuclear blast eviscerates a small U.S. Air Force base in the rural town of Damascus, Arkansas. The U.S. are swift to respond, firing a retaliatory strike at the U.S.S.R., which is dismissed by a Soviet officer as a false positive by their early detection satellites. As the American Titan II missiles plow through the Soviet countryside, the USSR is only able to mount a meager counterattack from remote satellite locations before it is completely wiped off the face of the Earth. China and France, in light of this sudden and terrifying American aggression, launch strikes of their own against the US. And after a short but intense series of reprisals, the world is razed to the ground by nuclear armed fire and human civilization along with it. Yet mankind is not doomed. During the Cold War, the Great, the Good, and the Gilded invested heavily in next-generation bomb shelters, enormous self-sustaining subterranean cryogenic compounds designed to preserve life until the outside world becomes habitable again. Compounds which, due to cost-cutting business measures in the name of competition and industrial espionage, failed to work entirely. Coolers. Bathed in lethal radiation, the greatest minds of the 20th century and all living memory of culture, technology, and agriculture are lost. While on the surface, the very hardiest specimens of humanity cling to life, survive, then thrive. From the ashes, a new world emerges. An ersatz post-apocalyptic stillborn 80s continues indefinitely, populated entirely by the toughest, meanest, and outright dumbest of God's creations, the wasters. Years later, however many know what you can say, even those who can count, the barren desert landscape of the western wastes is host to bitter factionalized warfare. The wasters fight tooth and nail over the most precious of natural resources, a liquid from beneath the sands that fuels all of uncivilization. Buried deep within the cooler's chambers, the very radiation that killed off society's chosen few imbued their potable provisions with a sick green glow and a radioactive buzz. Booze, it affectionately came to be known, and those dumb enough to weather its taste found themselves taking a sharp detour off the human evolutionary highway, mutating in strange and confounding ways, and acquiring both permanent brain damage and a ravenous addiction to the stuff. Against this backdrop of organized chaos, the wasters scrabble in the dirt, looking for just a drop of the good stuff, and the right guy in the wrong place at the right time with the wrong drink could be a major headache for those who seek power. I'm pretty sure that made about zero sense to all of you, but that's okay. We're about to get into the game. I know the audio might be a little bit low, so I'll try to fix that real quick. Once the actual gameplay starts. Oh! <laughs> uh. Let's see... Oh. 
Let's see, what do we want? Let's make the weirdest character possible. Kind of looks like a girl. Then they... Yeah. Alright, let's switch that one. I was about to say, it's like, wait a second. These are all women's styles. Alright. The fuck? They're kind of the same, though. Alright, let's choose this one. Uh, this got defaulted and color. What? That's not even a color. That's just like... There's no texture. All right, let's do that. Eyes. Oh my God. What? <laughs> um. He's angry. <laughs> let's do this one. Nose. What? Piggly nose. Pointed mouth. That's, wow. I, I might actually pick that one just because it looks funny. Oh. The peewee. I like that one. It's like the oddest one. There we go. We are done. All right, so let me just raise the audio real quick. Oh, okay. K, character, the good stuff. Journal, oh God, that's a little bit too loud. All right, so I. No boys, ribbon trans where we can see him. Yo, shoot him real quick. Hate to break it to you, but you've just wandered your way into becoming the new boys' first big score. Yeah, new boys, ribbon shred. Nothing personal. It's just how things work out here in the Western wastes. Uh, you do know how things work in the Western wastes, don't you? Uh, you sure about that? You know, these western wastes are a little more complicated than other wastes. Yeah, I mean, there's the shooting, which is more or less the same everywhere. But there's probably a lot of strange mechanics you might want to familiarize yourself with before you venture out. Yeah, doesn't hurt to know a mechanic, especially with that Angelus traffic. You sure you want to cut the crap and get straight to it? W well, crap. Wow. We're severely outmatched, new boys. Retreat! Retreat! And nobody got time for tutorials. We're learning on our way. Alright, so while we do that, cube key binding, jump, we'll change that to. Okay, apparently mouse buttons don't work for that. Gameplay. Um. Alright, this feels better. Alright, where are we going? We're going in. It feels kind of like Borderlands. going yeah let's not stand in that use can opener on door uh no I'm good your tinker in score is not high enough found 
Oh god! Time to turn you to paste! Time to turn you to paste! Time to Okay, so is there a take all button? Turn you to Point niner, can we equip that? Safety pants and rusty pistol. Got three TP. I don't know where we're going. Uh, that one's locked off. Ooh, a locker. I don't think that leads anywhere. Oh, you're dead. How did you even die? I didn't even come in this building. Left mouse button. It's broken. Very good. Hello? RIP! Listen. Didn't I have like a food thingy? Junk food? Uh, heals 10. Stuff for 30 seconds, okay. And those are our cooldowns. The way they die is just like the funniest thing. Wait a second. Base damage is 1 to 2. 1 to 2. DPS 10 to 20. Ooh, I think this one's better. Oh, uh, empty locker. Fantastic. Oh. Syndicate buzz kills. That hit detection, though. Drinking from an unmarked flask. Liquid bread. Uh, I guess I'll take that. That doesn't sound that good, though. Where's that music coming from? The radio is still on. I don't know how to get out of here. I was on target. Ooh. I can't see. 
Oh, we're dead. That purifier, unkillable. That's actually kind of scary. Where do we go? No, we can't. Alright, let's try to heal. So we have no ammo. Enemy spotted. Oh, we're dead. I got an achievement, though, for dying. I want to figure out how to get to the stick. Oh, that's how it works, huh? The fuck? Alright, so I guess take that junk food worth. Workbench obviously does crafting. We sleep here. Alright, so I guess that's our like safe house. And figuring things out now. It's 520 in the afternoon or night. <laughs> oh, apparently I can hurt myself by shooting a, uh, shooting those. Ooh, you can drive? Alright boys, we're going in round two.